The inauguration of Felix Chesikedi is about to get underway in Kinshasa. The ceremony is expected to mark the country's first ever peaceful handover of power after chaotic and bitterly disputed elections. We cross live to the ceremony that's taking place in Kinshasa. And so as you remember, uh, there were those elections in the DRC. They were held on the 30th of December. They were supposed to be held on the 23rd of December, but had to be postponed. They took place and uh, there was bitter contestation around the results. Uh, Felix Chesikedi was pronounced the provisional winner of those elections uh, and his uh, opponent who was close behind him Martin Fayulu uh, tried to contest that um, at a court at a, at a high court uh, and that was refused and uh, Mr Chisikedi's uh, his his uh, win was confirmed and so now today um, these uh, celebrations around his inauguration are taking place at the moment it's not clear whether he's actually arrived uh, but this is basically the background to the story um, there are obviously people in the DRC and outside the wider diaspora who are very happy about this um, this win and then of course there are others who are not but uh, as we mentioned in the introduction it's the first um, peaceful handover that we've seen in a number of years. Uh, the former president, uh, J uh, Joseph Kabila, he was uh, at the helm for a very long time, since about 2001 or so, uh, and uh, people felt that uh, he was uh, not governing in the best interests of the country uh, and more for himself. And so we'll wait to see uh, what the future holds for DRC. The DRC is a very um, heavily endowed um, country in terms of mineral resources. Uh, like the rest of the African content, the continent, it has so much potential. And so we wait to see um, how that country evolves under a new political dispensation but of course uh, when a country has been broken with wars and conflict and so on it will take years and years uh, for uh, the situation to be repaired so we're going to continue uh, keeping a track on these visuals and as soon as the inauguration kicks off uh, we'll hopefully cross to that